Nair, tech chase, he's gonna roll in down tilt. Why was I so ready for that? Why was I so ready and confident that he was gonna roll in consistently? Good afternoon, evening, or morning, ladies and gentlemen. We are back and I have some pleasant news and some L's later, but we have some pleasant news. I had the privilege of fighting, whoopsies, against Kobe, one of the greatest Florida players. I think he's top 10, actually. Um, yeah, he's probably top 10 in Florida, and all of Florida, which is really impressive because there's a lot of really, stop it. There's a lot of really good sub-regions in Florida, and he's one of the best. And he, uh, he does play Young Link. He mains Young Link. So he does go Lucina in Young Link's worst matchups, which oddly enough is Young Link himself. So when I played him yesterday in a set, he opted to go Lucina. So we're going to do a VOD review because this, ladies and gentlemen, is how I took a set off of uh, one of the best Young Link players and one of the best Florida players there is. So I already know that Lucina's tough for me. I had to be very careful with how I hit my buttons, right? I hit him with down tilt. He knows nothing's true here. He plays the character. We both play the character. We both know this. Nothing can happen here except for maybe uh, I should have probably ran under the platform and went for an up air sharking. But I'm not that smart. So I went for, oh, I got to go for the true combo, right? And he just nair ones me into back air. The perfect decision. I mean, maybe force match would have killed, but with my amazing frame data. Good tech. And the up B to kill. Uh, didn't work out. I'm not sure how or why this happened. I throw bomb up B. Not because I thought it would hit, but because I thought he would drop shield. And like run away or something. This right here. He up B's me so late. And I, I was able to shield it. And then he SD's. What percent was he at? Was he actually at zero? There's no way. He was actually at zero. Oh my god. Oh my god. He. Yeah, and then he kills me right after. He likes to hold shield because he knows I'm going to hit a button. And I haven't been grabbing him. So I should have been more um, open to the... That was the worst punish I've ever seen. Like right here, just turn around, grab, down throw, up air, call it a day. Because like, come on, accelerate. You know he's shielding. You, he knows that you know that he knows that you just want to hit buttons. He uppies. This is a beautiful opportunity for just any combo starter. Any combo starter. Any. And I just go for a bear one that misses because Lucina's animation has her crouching. I know that now. And I get reversal for it. I get reversal, which should have been my combo because I missed my bear one because of Lucina's animation that I didn't know about. Now that I know about it, this won't happen again. I will opt to down tilt or up B in the future. So oh, the spot on the forward tilt. I'm sick. Back air, boomerang, arrow. The pressure. Boomerang again. Ooh, ha! the pressure. Up air. Oh, I waited because I thought he was going to do something like counter or something. Which actually, I don't think I should have waited because it was true. Okay, so this was because I thought he was going to stay shielding. Like he's been doing. But he's a smart player. So I go for a tomahawk down tilt. And before I can get down tilt, he uppies immediately. Because he knows I've done it before. Actually, I've done it before. I did the full hop fastball into down tilt. So he knows I'm probably going to down tilt if I don't go for an aerial. I should have shielded. I could have shielded. I could have. I could have hard punished that. And that was really good. Nobody ever punishes with my bomb recovery like that, and they sh really should. Cause look how look how optimal this was. He drifts in, goes for a forward air. I have to respect it. Jumps back. Like he did it perfectly. I don't know why I was holding it down. I'll be honest with you. Like I'm this ain't melee. I'm not. I'm not trying to crouch cancel. I should have just shielded. He does this. This is an up air. This is 100% an up air. I've never seen something more up air in my life. Oh my god. 
And I back. I neutral air. That's even worse. Because at least back air was like, okay, I'm trying to follow his drift. But I neutral air because I'm a doofus. Do you see that? You see that? This is what happened. This is this is what we call set play. So I am like, okay, he expected me to do an aerial. Like that's what usually what I do. I hit his shield with aerials, right? So what I do, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna fast fall. But this time, I'm not going to down tilt because he's been showing that he's going to shield my down tilt and an upbeat. I dropped down shielded because I thought he was going to upbeat right away. He didn't. He's smart. He's waiting for me to touch his shield. I didn't touch his shield. So I should have grabbed here because I hadn't done that yet. I've only done that once. I down air again. Boo! I don't pull bomb. Good job, Kevin. And I upbeat. I probably shouldn't have upbeat, to be honest with you. But hey, it won. Down air. I don't pull bomb. I go in. Okay, that's game one. Uh, he got greedy. He wanted to kill. Or he wanted to get me off stage. He thought I would swing. Oh, yeah, he definitely thought I would nair out a shield. That killed him. That killed him. I am being very careful not to swing right now. There it is. There's the combo. Very cool. 43% for losing his focus on the ledge. Grab. Finally, I started calling out their shields. That's fine. Yeah, I reset neutral for that. I got out of the ledge and I reset neutral with that. That's fine. I'll, I'll give it that. That was not perfectly spaced. That's fine. I understand. So I got shield grabbed. Okay, cool. Up tilt. Yeah, that's going to take time. I've been neutral get upping way too much. This is when I realized right here that I wasn't using many projectiles at all. I was straight up boxing with Lucina. And I'm like, let me just throw out more projectiles. So I pull back and I arrow more. And I'm like, oh, that, that's why. That was sick. I don't know how I did this. That's how I knew I was playing well. I get hit. I get off the stage. I didn't get hit by all the side beats. I jump up forward air one. From the ledge, Nair conversion? Oh my god, you're sick! The ledge trump that Young Link should be doing more? Oh! So right here, is a very bad spot for me to be in. Forward forward air so i hit i get hit by two forward airs there is it this is a 50 50 whether lucina is going to predict my jump or not i figured he's probably not going to predict my jump he's going to predict me go for something safe like go down there so i'm going to jump and he catches my jump and i'm like well crap <laughs> so i have to air dodge and i do that i air dodge again semi super semi taught me this if you directional up and in so if you just if I just directional in, I'm gonna die. But if I directional up and in, like at an angle, I still I can get left enough to where I can recover, and I can uh get up enough to where like I can uh act sooner. And I tech it in it because I'm a god. Cool. So because of that, I lived. I lived that exchange just because I was calm under pressure, and I'm very grateful for that. So I retreat to center stage. I'm out. I am out. I took my damage, that's fine. Okay, I hit him. I expect him to roll in. I throw a boomerang. I was supposed to get a hard punish. I missed. That's my bad. I, do you know why I, I, th I thought that? Do you know why back in the first game, I thought the same thing? Um, Nair, tech chase, he's going to roll in down tilt. Why was I so ready for that? Why was I so ready and confident that he was going to roll in? Consistently. Right here. Boom. I knew it. I knew it. So this is when I was like, oh, he's probably going to roll in. And I will catch that with a boomerang. Ever since this moment. This was almost two years ago. Almost two years ago. I had a feeling. 
that he would do it again. That's why, that's why I was so confident he was going to roll in. We were here. This, this is why I was so confident he was going to roll in. Because he's done it before. He was done it before and earlier in the set, he did it again. And I'm like, wow. I have a feeling this is the Kobe thing. Where he likes to, uh, when he's put into a tech scenario at such an earlier percent, he's going to roll in. You drop it. Why am I so goddamn stupid? Every single time, every single time I have a good opening like this, I think of what can kill here. What what move? Let's let's break it down, shall we? Let's break it down. What move can kill here? What of Young Link's toolkit can I do that will say rest in peace? Also, let it be known this is the second time he's done this. What can I do here? I can. Not neutral air. I can down air. Maybe that won't kill. Probably. To be honest with you, down air probably won't kill. I can down smash. I can forward smash. I can up smash. I can maybe down air. I can back air one, forward air one, or into up smash. I can do charge forward smash. I can do... Uh, I already said that. You get the point. I had a huge opportunity. I had I could have down tilted. I could have down tilted. Youngling's literal best option. Instead, I drop my controller. I throw it across the venue. I didn't want anything to do with it. If this cost me the set, I would have been so infuriated at myself. I'm pretty upset at myself. The fact that I always get caught in these situations and my first instinct is I got to up B. Instead of doing a freaking obvious down smash, up smash, forward smash, down air, down tilt. I'm so upset at myself specifically for down tilt because down tilt is like the most common young link thing that will kill. I instantly regretted this. I instantly regretted it. So do you know what I did? I was like, you know what? I'm going to run up and up smash. I'm just going to run up to him. Ready? Right here. Right here. You'll notice I misinputted a run up up smash, which would have worked, mind you. It would have worked based on the option that Kobe did. I ran up and tried to up smash him to catch him, and it didn't work because I misinputted a dash deck. I mi Dude, he ran, he jumped in there. My up smash would have caught that any day of the week. Any day. To be fair though, he sent me off stage, and guess what happens off stage? I can die. So yeah, I'm very lucky this this warrior didn't kill or hit me. I'm not sure how or why. Up smash. No. Is there? <laughs> My feet barely missed. I can't wait for the vods to be on YouTube or something so I can see this frame by frame. But god dang. This is probably frame off. I'm not saying frames off. I'm saying this is probably frame singular off. Wow. <laughs> Round of applause. Round of applause.